Oh, I'm ready today, baby. I feel myself becoming more depressed the less Attack on Titan I watch. Which is gonna be horrible once the show actually ends. I just got back from Anime Expo in LA, and I'm ready to finish this show once and for all. Because everywhere I looked, there was a spoiler. If someone came up to me during that expo and hit me with a spoiler, I promise you, I would not be on camera right now. Neither would that person ever be. All right, bitches, let's get to the show. Episode 81. Is this show gonna go to episode 100? Imagine that episode. Yo. <laughs> Imagine what that baby's thinking right now. <sighs> and he's dead? Wait, 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 wait! The episode's called Thor! Annie is inside that cr Yo. This is incredible. Uh. It's like the end of the world. Everybody is destroyed right now. Eren is in full control. The world is, is falling apart right now. Wow. Fuck that hit me. This show. I don't know when it begins anymore. I'm just gonna believe that it never begins. Look at Reiner caring about the world. It makes you question who the protagonist and the antagonist is during the entire show. And this is season four! And I still don't know who's good or bad. Nobody named Aunt Karina is gonna still be alive. I mean, Gabby almost did kill him. Dude, Gabby was the closest to killing Eren. Think about that. With a gun. Everybody tried, but Gabby got the closest. Imagine he wasn't that close to Zeke. He would have been dead. He would have been gone. The founding Titan can make all Titans and subjects of Ymir obey its will. I feel like the only way Eren loses is if Eren beats Eren. <laughs> Two of my favorite characters in the show in the same room right now. Just talking about what we're going from here. What was that transition? <laughs> Gabby! Team Gabby, bitches! Oh my god, Gabby's doing everything! Just give her the fucking Titan! Oh shit! Rhino was right. Connie and John got Falco. Now they're really devils. Dude, it's like the world's perception of Paradise Island is becoming more true by the season, by the episode, because now the devils are really becoming the devils. And that perception, their the ideology they placed upon that the what they thought they were they've become they created these monsters and now they are answering for their sins but at the same time it's not right so take that how you will yeah yo Fuck. john well, we're the same person how many are there it's genocide of unprecedented scale what a fucking sentence Wow. Oh my god. That is top five moments for me right there. Oh shit. Fuck. Them coming to the realization. Oh my god, bro. It's too early for this shit. What time is it? Oh my god. Ah. That was beautiful. Like the silence. The music stopping. With the destruction going on in the background. And that flashback of Eren explaining to them that they're the only ones that mean something to him. So he will do anything to protect them. Even if it means destroying his own humanity. Sacrificing his own humanity to benefit their lives. To make it better for them. But at the same time, is this life? Is this what they want? So it's like a battle. It's confliction right there of, of humanity and just the power to live. The, the will to survive and to make a better life for them. Is this what they want? Is this how they want to live? Is this life? Ugh. Oh, the fucking ugly titans are back. Oh, no! I love how the main characters are here right now. Please, lead them away from this shit. 
He's carrying. He's carrying Falco like a hoodie. What? No. Fuck your mom. No. This don't no. No, I want Falco to live. I don't care about your mom and Ragako. Nobody cares about your mom, Connie. I forgot your name at one point in the show. Yes, she doesn't. I think that's what I'm saying. Connie, I was gonna say Connie, I love you, but I don't. I don't like Connie. Nick, what? Connie's my favorite. No, no. If Connie's your favorite, I'm judging you. No, I'm not judging you. But still, come on. Come on. But Nick, it's his mom. If your mom was... You, you probably don't know me. If my mom became a titan, that bitch could die. <laughs> he used the b b b b b b b word. b b b b Oh, you son of a bitch. Connie, world destruction's happening right now. You think your mom cares? About surviving? What's your mom gonna do with this the grand scheme of things? Yo, Yelena. Oh my god, that's right. She's fooled, bro. She's a puppet. Aaron's controlling her like a puppet. Ugh, not her. Not the ugly kids again. You dumbass. Wow. You heard that? That was my heart exploding. Gabby is the hero of the story. She is the strongest daughter of a bitch. What the fuck is this music, man? Oh my god! No, baby! I love her. Oh, fuck. I take it back. You know the scene before? Nah, that got bumped out of the top five. That's one of the top five moments right there. That symbolism. Her tying up her hair to the point where she looks like Sasha. She's the one that killed Sasha. Now she's the one that saved Kaya. It's like she's she's dealing with her sins for killing Sasha. And now she's like replaced. Not replacing her. You can't replace anybody. Especially Sasha, you son of a bitch. But your daughter of a bitch, I mean. But now it's like she is... Just trying to do good. Just trying to fulfill her purpose. Beautiful. If you call Falco Ben one more time... Oh. Oh. Listen, I'd kill those little, those those little those little ugly bastards on the left. I just I don't know, man. They're the ugliest kids I've ever seen in my life, especially the one on the right. She killed his daughter, and look how they're treating her. Guys, guys, no, no. You hear this destruction going on in the background? I've never been this emotional this early. Only Attack on Titan does this to me. No death of my family would- Oh my gosh, she just called herself a devil. Oh my god. It's the symbolism, the the realization of, of, of things. We're seeing her grow every episode. Gabby killed her sister, the, the, the girl that saved her life in the beginning from the Titan. And Gabby killed his girlfriend, the love of his life. And look at them protecting Gabby now. The little kid that just didn't look at Sasha as Sasha, but just as the devil, as a devil. Just another another one of those devils that are here to ruin her life and her hometown, destroying her city. It wasn't like a personal thing. And them realizing that, putting that aside and realizing that they did this, that, that, that this isn't hatred. This is just pure... Oh, look at this shot. Listen to this dialogue. No human being created this. An alien created this. Are those Mikasa's legs? Oh, wait, no. My man's back! Hey! That's right! Y'all like kicking his ass now, right? You're gonna suck his dick, his old dick? You better before he dies. Yeah, yeah. Y'all are gonna suck up to them now, right? Now y'all know what the real deal is. <laughs> Look who's in charge now. 
Every episode is amazing! It's not just good! The fuck was that? Oh my god! God, oh, I just, oh, shit. The part of me just disappeared. Oh, my God, them looking down at him and, no, not the flashbacks! Leader John, oh, God, oh, I'm hard. Is this show real? Is this show real? Are they going to be walking for the rest of the season? That action sequence was incredible. Incredible. I'm not going to be alright when the show ends. I might as well die after the show ends. I've seen all life. We're gonna see characters coming together now that were at odds the entire season. Oh my god, we're gonna see a team up. We're gonna see a fucking team up with Gabby! I'm never gonna forgive that, Connie. Never. Never. I want him to die before now. Oh my god. I hope his mom eats him. I'm so glad Gabby is with them. They're forgiving. Mikasa and Armin. This is the god team up. This was not her in the first episode. Look how her whole mindset changed. Fuck, Gabby. Oh my god, Ryder's gonna be teaming up with them now, too! Oh, this is the best. This is the best season. This is the best show ever. God, no way. <laughs> so much happened in this episode. The battle, the, the, the action sequences are always top notch in this show, but add that music to this episode that they used, and it was even better. One of the best action sequences on the show so far. John taking leadership, seeing Pixies as a Titan, Gabby saving Kaya, like Sasha saved Kaya, but Gabby killing Sasha, but saving Kaya, it's like full circle how everything's happening, how her hair looks, Kaya looking at Gabby as if it was her older sister, Sasha. Beautiful. Those little moments like that are, are so crucial in making the show ha as legendary as it is. The music in this episode was top notch. The animation, don't even get me started. Reiner's armor coming undone, which I didn't fully realize until they said it. Falco in Connie's fucking arms going to Connie's mom. I hate that bitch. She's a tight. No, no, I hate Connie. It's not the mom's fault. It's Connie's fault. Nick, but it's his mom. I, I don't give a fuck. I don't care. Everybody else's mom died in this show. What's so special about Connie's mom? Annie is back. And y'all are asking, why am I so excited? Because I hated Annie. I love people I hate. It's cool. You need characters like that. And she looks the same. She was hardened since like season one or two. I can't remember. We're finally going to see her back now. And everybody regrouping. We're going to have these people that were at odds for the last season or two. Coming together like Yappy with Mikasa and Armin. With Reiner. They're all going to come back together. And Oh my god. I'm not ready for this guys. Anyways. Yeah. That's going to be it for today's video. I will see you all in the next one. Oh, God, I might just react to it now.